There is a long and rich tradition of people moving to the mountains, seeking better jobs and opportunities for their families. That practice and the demanding work that goes along with it continues to this day. Working in the mountains is often rewarding for those who brave the elements, but it comes with risk. One of those risks is responsible for the lives of almost 30 people in the United States every year. Since 1950, workplace avalanches alone have resulted in more than 70 deaths. So the consequences here are very real. UDOT is mourning the death of an avalanche forecast. But with a little knowledge, they are also very avoidable. In the next hour, we'll talk about how and where avalanches happen and give you an approach to avalanche safety that you can use at work. The information you need is out there. The equipment you need is out there. The people that can help you are out there. And with just a little bit of your time, we can help keep you out there, keep you working, and make sure you come home every day.